what's up you guys? Welcome back to the Elegance YouTube channel. My name is Adriana and I help young professionals easily style outfits for a successful career. We have a really fun video today and that is how to style different types of blazers. So we have seven different types of blazers for you to give you some inspiration as to how you can style them for the office. Before we jump in, don't forget to hit that big red subscribe button and to hit the bell to be notified every single time I post a new video every week. Okay, so let's jump into the seven different ways that you can style a blazer. The first one we're gonna cover is a little bit more unconventional and that is the leather blazer. So you can wear leather at the office if it looks presentable and acceptable. In this case, it's got that nice blazer shape, a little cute peplum type of blazer look. It sits right on the hips and is a little bit cropped so it's not too long and it styles beautifully with different types of suits. Uh, in this case, I styled it with a pencil skirt and a blouse underneath. As long as the rest of your outfit is corporate looking and professional, you can always throw on that blazer for a little touch of edge with your office outfit and that little extra touch of glam as well. I love mixing the black blazer as well with black palazzo pants or black flared dress pants because the black in the dress pants tends to be a different shade of black than the black on the leather blazer. So it gives a contrast, it gives a different interesting dynamic feel to it and it really looks professional for work. To the leather blazer, you can always add a really cute clutch or a nice professional square looking bag for the office to tie the leather in together. So you have the leather in your handbag with the leather in your blazer to pair things together. Or if you don't carry a handbag, maybe you wanna wear a pair of leather high heels or shoes. It can always be vegan leather. This is the faux leather blazer that I'm wearing in this picture here. But whatever you have on hand, whatever is easy for you to get access to, pair that leather with another element of leather in your outfit and you'll be able to tie it all together and make it look seamless and awesome for work. The second blazer look is a long blazer. I love a long blazer because I think they are so chic. They elongate the body, they make you look super sophisticated, and they pair nicely with a lot of different garments for work. This is also a great one that you can wear to the office on casual Friday because it can add a, that touch of professionalism to a very casual outfit. So in this look, I simply paired my long blazer over a black t-shirt and a black pair of jeans. It's perfect for that casual Friday, really easy to throw on and keeps things looking elegant and simple and sophisticated at the same time. If you wanna dress it up as one step further for casual Friday, add a cute boot heel or maybe a nice pair of statement earrings and you'll be able to finish off that really professional look for your casual Friday. So long blazer again is so, so elegant and very flattering on the figure because it hits the curves at the right spots. So it cinches in at the waist a little bit to give you that illusion of a smaller waist and it falls onto your hips very seamlessly giving you that nice hourglass shape on the back. So if you are somebody that doesn't really have an hourglass figure or you have more of an athletic looking body, what you can do to give yourself a little bit more curves if you'd like is throw on that long blazer to give you that perfect seamless hourglass look. The third type of blazer that we're going to talk about today is the double breasted blazer. Not only are these blazers super trendy, but they are very flattering on the figure too. So because they tend to be a little bit longer um, than just hitting you at the waist, they tend to sit more around the hips. It's also going to elongate your torso. You're going to look super elegant in it. And it's an easy way for you to incorporate a trend into your office wardrobe because it's also, it's one of those trendy timeless items that you can wear for a really long time because it is a blazer, even though the double breasted is currently really in. So how I paired this blazer was with a pair of cigarette pants, very simple cigarette pants, because it allowed me to give myself that really nice hourglass shape once again. Uh, because it does hit a little lower without being too, too revealing at the office at the same time. So I love a great double-breasted blazer with a nice cigarette pant. I have also worn this double-breasted blazer with long flared dress pants at the office, but sometimes I feel like that look is maybe a little bit too um, baggy for my figure, but if you prefer a baggier look, then this might be a great option for you. I preferred it, however, with a nice pair of cigarette pants. 
The third way I've styled this double-breasted blazer in the past as well is with a dress. I love wearing a super cute dress for the office, throwing on that double-breasted blazer and calling it a day. And you can even take it that one step further and tie the blazer with a belt to give you that cinch at the waist and to give you the illusion that your blazer is kind of part of your dress. So this, these are three easy ways for you to style your double-breasted blazer. The fourth type of blazer that you can style is the simple black classic blazer. This is an absolute staple in every woman's closet for the office. It is a go-to blazer that everybody should have because it's so versatile and easy to throw on. Now, if you need more tips on your staple items, I have a staple items checklist that you can check out in the description box below where you'll be able to make sure that you have all of your staple items for the office. This black blazer in particular is really a key one and can make a difference in how you get dressed in the morning. So this blazer, I like to style it personally with the different colored elements in my look while remaining neutral. So sometimes I will do the all black look. I will wear the black blazer with a white button up and black dress pants, keeping it very suit-like, very classic, very simple. Other times, however, I like to mix it up. So I will throw on the black blazer over a black blouse and wear uh, a baggier dress pants in a khaki color. So I love this look. It's a little bit more um, youthful, more trendy, more in style for the office while remaining professional at the same time. And the key difference here is that everything, nothing is exposed. So your behind is not exposed. You're not flaunting all of your curves too explicitly at the office, but you're still remaining um, within your style, within your age, ra age range and uh, professional at the same time. So that black blazer can really go with a lot of things. Like I said, I like to wear it sometimes with loose uh, dress pants. Other times I like to wear it with uh, tighter khaki dress pants to mix it up and to give it that dynamic feel because like I mentioned, that black blazer is super, super versatile, so you can pair it with colors, you can pair it with neutral colors, like the khaki, and you can pair it with simple black. The fifth blazer we're gonna talk about is a classic light colored blazer. So in this case, I have a white blazer that I love. This is an unexpected way to wear a blazer. A lot of people don't think to wear light colored blazer to work, but they can be very chic and very professional as well, just as much as a darker colored blazer. So I like to pair my white blazer with black for the most part. I really like that contrast of the white and the black. Other times I will like the contrast of the white and a navy blue. So this is also a great option for you. Um, a light color blazer is a good way for you to also tame a bright color in a look. So let's say you're wearing a bright color like neon, maybe not neon, but like fuchsia or magenta pink ensemble or maybe a, just a blouse that's fuchsia or like that magenta pink that's very, very bright. You wanna maybe tone that down a little bit for the office. Wearing a white blazer is the perfect way to do so. It's especially great for the summertime, but you can wear this white blazer or, or this light colored blazer in the winter time too. I will mix it up, it depends on the season. In the summertime, I do like to wear my white blazer with my navy blue cigarette dress pants, but in the, in the summertime, but in the winter time, I prefer wearing my white blazer with a white button up, having that white on white, and then following that with a pair of black dress pants. So it's making this suit look very classic, very professional, but also gives it a twist because normally people would have worn or paired the white button up with a black, uh, with a black a blazer. In my case, I prefer to pair it with a white blazer. So this is a great way for you to style your light colored blazers for the office. The sixth type of blazer that we're going to talk about today is a cropped colorful blazer. So a cropped blazer is a really fun way to mix things up as well because we always think, when we think of the word blazer, we think of that classic black seamless blazer, which there's nothing wrong with that, but it's also fun to mix things up with a more cropped boxy blazer. So in this case, I'm wearing a colorful one. Um, it's really a fun piece to add to my corporate wardrobe to add in some color because a lot of the times, like it's so hard to add that color into your wardrobe. If you need some tips on how to add color into your wardrobe, check out this little video in the eye up above on how to add color to your office wardrobe because it could really give you some inspiration as to how to brighten things up for the winter time, especially when it's so dark these times, this time of year. 
Um, but anyway, this cropped boxy blazer can be hard to style, but when it's done right, can look very, very chic. So the way to style this blazer is because it's so cropped and square, you wanna wear something that flatters your bottom figure very, very well. So in this case, I chose a pair of palazzo pants, uh, flare dress pants, but you can also choose a pair of cigarette pants for work. Another great way to style this boxy blazer is with a fitted pencil skirt because it's seamless and it's, it's easy to wear. Um, and it gives you that contrast of fitted and slim at the bottom and a little bit baggier and boxy at the top. So this is how I would style this cropped blazer for work. This next blazer is a suede blazer. This is actually very unexpected, definitely not gravitated towards for the most part. People don't think to wear suede as much in a blazer form to work, but it is a good way to mix things up. So you can throw this over a nice dress because it is cropped. You can wear it uh, again, a little bit like the, the other cropped blazer. You could wear it with those cigarette pants. Those are some simple ways for you to style that suede blazer and to play with texture. So what's great about the suede texture is that it's soft. So you can wear something that's a little bit more rigid in the rest of your outfit or something that is maybe a little bit either silky or maybe just a simple cotton will do the trick as well. But play with those textures, mix things up and style your suede blazer in a way that will make you feel like you're not wearing something too baggy in your whole outfit, but that will still look professional for the office. So like I said, I love pairing the suede blazer with a dress underneath because it gives that contrast of textures, but also keeps things professional and classy. So there you have it. This, these are the seven ways that you can style a blazer for work. Comment below which look you liked the best. I would really wanna know which look you like to style the most or which blazers you already have in your closet. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that big red subscribe button and, to, and hit the bell to be notified when I post a new video here on the Elegance YouTube channel. If you wanna watch more, here is a video on how you can style pencil skirts for work. And here is a video I mentioned about how to integrate color into your office wardrobe. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I will see you guys next week with a new video. Bye.